Hey, what's going on guys? Jake the Happy Snake here, and welcome back to Mario Kart DS. Last time, uh, just give me a second here, I'm just going to adjust the volume, actually it was good where it was. Okay, so last time we finished up things on the Nitro Grand Prix. Uh, we finished up, we uh, did the Special Cup. In this episode, we are going to start off uh, in the Retro Grand Prix, which um, they are, all these Grand Prix are, uh, have races from previous Mario Kart games. Um, so here we go with the Shell Cup. There are the races, Mario Circuit 1, Moomoo Farm, Peach Circuit, and Luigi Circuit. I never did that in the previous um, episodes, like where I said what races were in the Grand Prix, but I'm going to do it for the rest of the playthrough because it just seems to be more efficient that way. So let's get started here with the Shell Cup. So here we go, this race is from um, Mario Kart Super Circuit. Or nah, not Super Circuit. Uh, Super Mario Kart, the very first Mario Kart game to ever exist. It released 24, <clears throat> 24 years ago. So that's exciting. Haha, <laughs> poor Bowser. He did. He deserved that, man. He really did. Come back here. Come back here. Oh dang. Yeah, this is a really short race. Um, I've almost been able to lap at this race. I actually, I'm pretty sure I have lapped in the past. I think I've lapped eighth place, but it's really hard to do. But it is entirely possible. Actually, it's possible to lap anybody at any at any race. But this race, it's um, it's a bit easier. And a blue shell came at the end. Thankfully, the race was over. So yeah. See, my first lap was 18 seconds. Like it's a pretty short race. The whole it didn't even take me a minute to actually uh, to finish that race. Here we are, at Moomoo Farm from Mario Kart 64. This is the shortest race in Mario Kart 64, um, but it's a really it's a pretty good race. I have to say, I don't mind this race at all. It's not too difficult. It has its challenging points because if you see, if you saw there it had. Uh, Random moles that pop out of absolutely nowhere. Well, actually, no. They come out of the... You can see holes. See right there? See, you can see holes. But, yeah. They can be kind of annoying, yeah. All right, Bowser. Let's go. Aha! He should have been a banana. Oh, no, so did I. Crap. Okay. All right, that's fine. Hey Mario, what's up? Haha, ha, poor Mario, gonna get hit by a blue shell. Oh shoot. Alrighty. Yeah, for some reason, I don't, I'm not, I'm not sure I've mentioned this previously, but for some reason, red shells sometimes hit you, sometimes they don't. Um, like if you have like um, like a banana behind you or or something, they, they, they like the red shells sometimes will hit you, but they but they won't. I don't really understand it, but it's just the way the game works. Oh boy, that was close. That was close. That was close. Okay, woo! I almost I almost hit a banana. But yeah, I don't know. Like sometimes they the red shells come in front of you and they, they hit you that way, or sometimes they just hit you in the back. And if you ha if you're lucky enough to have a banana or a green shell um, behind you, then you won't get hit because the red shell will just cancel out the cancel each other out. So yeah. But anyways, now we're at, here at Peach Circuit from Super. This one is from Super Circuit. Okay, I I promise you that. And I did not get the head start because I was too busy talking. I feel like I can hear music. I think my uh, neighbors are actually having a party. I mean, I'm recording this on a Saturday night, so I get... I'm recording this at 10.30 on a Saturday night, so I guess, uh, I guess uh, there's a lot of parties going on. It makes sense. So yeah, I'm officially on summer vacation. I'm not sure about you guys. Well, I'm assuming you guys are at this point, but uh, yeah, pretty exciting. It's always a good feeling when you get done uh, a school year. All right, 
guys, come on. Hello. I never understood what Bowser says. He's, is he saying good eye? Good eye. Like, I never. No! No! Yes! Bowser, you keep doing that. It's like the third time this Grand Prix he has done that. Thank you, Bowser. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I do that every time. All oh, right, I that was amazing how he how he hit that at the very end. I that was complete luck. All right, final race of the Grand Prix, Luigi Circuit from Double Dash. This race is kind of uh, I I don't know. I, uh, it's not one of my favorite races. Come on, Mario, seriously. Uh, it's not one of my favorite races, but I guess it's okay. I don't know. Like, I, it's weird how you can, like, go to the other side and, like, you can see, like, the other racers. Like, you can, like, if 8th place is doing bad enough, you can, like, run, run into them right there. I don't know. It's kind of weird, but, uh, yeah. I swear I can hear music. I can, I can feel like the vibrations, okay? I, I swear that the neighbors are having a party. Which is kind of weird because I'm like talking really loudly right now and the game is really loud. There's a lot of commotion going on. Meanwhile, I can still hear the music. I don't know. Anyways, I'm first! Yeah! That's exciting. No! Why? Why does this game hate me so much? No! No! Yo! Finally! I came first every single race. I don't think it's happened yet in any of the Grand Prix. So that's good. Anyways, that is the end of this Grand Prix. So next time we will, we will be taking on the Banana Cup, I believe. I, I'm not too well. I'm not too good with the uh, with the retro uh, cups um, because they didn't come until this game. Actually, this is the first game that had retro uh, cups. So yeah. Uh, next time I'll be taking on the Banana Cup, so thank you guys so much for watching, I really appreciate it. I'm going to have a link in the description below uh, to my Facebook page, so please check that out, that would be really appreciated. And I will see you all next time. Peace.